well, Liam, after a couple of chaotic first weeks, your first win has finally come. How good does that feel? Um, well, yeah, it's, it's fantastic for the football club, but you know, I've got to say the players take all the credit. Uh, not, not, nothing to do with me. Um, you know, you see the, the honesty shines through. Uh, the effort, the endeavour, they've been exactly the same since I walked through the door and uh, you know, the result probably deserved over the, the three performances that, that, have, uh, that have been here. Um, you know, we, we had to give possession up at times in certain areas of the pitch with the players that we've got available and the attributes that, that we carry, but we always feel you know, we, can, we can contain and we, and we can cause you know, problems in certain areas. But uh, like I say, the players take all the credit today. You mentioned that honesty. You've seen their battling credentials a couple of times already in your reign, but that was a real good example that these players won't give up until it's over. No, no, and rightly so. You know, there's, there's, a, you know, I'm a big believer. With all due respect, the pressure for for the players is, you know, the performance, how they look after themselves, how they train, how they, how they live their lives to be a professional footballer and represent the shirt. You know, my pressure is the results. They don't take that pressure. I take that pressure. And you know, there's a level of performance, really, a foundation where, you know, certain people, individuals can't stop you doing certain things. And you know, we we built that in abundance. And if we start there, um, and then grow as a as a group, and like you say, the importance of getting players back is huge. Um, because in the in, in the championship, the, the fixtures are, are thick and fast, and the challenges are, are huge. But uh, you know, today the, the players, like I said before, the players deserve all the credit for that win. As you say, the graph was the bedrock of that performance, and the match stats might not quite paint the picture, but there was some style out there as well at times. Yeah, absolutely. You know, we know what what we what we are, what we've got, and you know the areas what we what we kind of excel in. Um, and like I say, the lads have took information in terrifically well. You know, the, down at Plymouth, possibly should have had a positive result. I thought on Saturday against Leicester. Like I said, for 60, 65 minutes, we were, we were good value. And, and today, you know, we had to defend at times, you know, against good teams, you have to defend. And, and like you say, we had, we had opportunities where, of course, we can be a bit better with a little bit of luck with the goal. But like I said, if you're not fit enough and able enough to be in that position to earn that luck, you won't get there. And, you know, Cohen is, is that. And it typifies with, you know, a couple of saves off Victor, um, lads returning from, you know, off the bench on the, in, you know, off the injury front to, to help, you know, with the cause and, uh, and again, just to repeat again, uh, you know, the, the lads deserve all the credit uh, for the result out there. You can obviously control the tactical preparation for these games, but you can't kind of make them jump in front of shots and block things on the line, but they've done all that in abundance today. Yeah, that's a choice. That's a choice. And they make good choices with regards to, to things, you know, such as, such as that. And, um, and like I say, with, I think Rob Kelly just said 42 years, I think he reported back on July uh, the 1st for, 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 for the seasons. And... You know, I think the biggest compliment is, is gave them is, you know, they're, they're a very, very honest, hardworking um, bunch of players who want to represent the shirt the best that they can. And, uh, you know, you do that and, you know, you'll get more rewards for that. You probably had your head in your hands with some of the luck you've had since you've been in charge. But today, that Cohen Bramall strike, perhaps a tad of fortune, just in your favour. Yeah, it's the, the old adage, isn't it? The harder you work, the luckier you get. You know, the lads have worked terrifically hard since I've been in. You know, it's gone to Plymouth and on to Leicester, then back here against Middlesbrough, you know, in the top six who are flying high, they've got a plethora of squad, you see the subs that are coming on every game at the minute and you know, lads are in, in, in our squad are having to play out of position, having to do different roles that are quite foreign to them but they're giving it a, they're giving it a really good go and they're giving a really good count of themselves you know, for each other as well but you know, for themselves as well. Just a word on your subs as well, you've not been able to fill the bench but the lads who did come on once again had an impact for you. Yeah and that's, 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 that's what you know, is so important, the lads who start the game, you know, obviously carry information out and work terrific hard to try and get a positive result but uh, with all due respect, the lads who come on, it's, it's you know the pressure's on them to finish the job or continue, you know the good work that's been going on. So it's it's a given for me, and uh, you know thankfully today we were able to get a couple of lads on the pitch and get them a few minutes in them, and uh, and they were part of that positive result as well.